If the origin of art was to pass on the spirit of um, each age from next gen generation to next generation, um, that's how I wish my art to be. I think often how my work starts is um, by encountering certain sight either in urban or natural landscape. Uh, but often I encounter a certain place that really inspires me. And, and I leave it often like a few months, like four months, five, sometimes five months, sometimes even years. And then if I don't forget them, I would go back and I know exactly what I want to do like swiping desert or splashing water in desert, um, those perhaps absurd things um, that is not based on purpose, but um, that's the place, that's the time I can contemplate. Most of my work disappears in the end through evaporation or um, nothing is solid and therefore um, the work becomes record of it. I would like to kind of work with like human nature, such as like love or belief or faith. And I hope my work to kind of evoke its beauty, but at the same time, its absurdity and kind of futility or violence of it. My work is more showing the kind of condition of those human nature. There is a specific project that I started since April this year, um, which is specifically um, based on an incident that happened in Japan in March um, caused by earthquake and the tsunami afterwards and um, I flew back to Japan and did some intervention in struggling area and that project is called inverted horizon I think how I want to continue this project in this residency is not a responsive way of uh, this incident but more kind of um, abstracted version of it, that is um, nature and human civilization and a boundary between these two, a boundary between nature and human civilization and its harmony and dissonance. I find a time of being a Florence Trust is really like um, building my own sanctuary the building itself is very inspiring, but also coming here just even 30 minutes a day really gives me time to contemplate. You don't need to work for a specific project or specific exhibition or um, specific purpose, but just um, give me a freedom to ask a question again and talk to myself and purely concentrate on making things, which is very different from school, where you have teacher and then um, sometimes teacher tell you, well, I think this is this and why don't you go for that? But actually what I found uh, after I graduated university is that a lot of answers, you actually already have it in yourself. But, um, you just have to sometimes question yourself and tackle with it. And it's, it's going to be more meaningful if you find that answer um, not being advised by someone else. And I think residency is a place um, 
for that really there is no hierarchy there is no um, yeah specific aims or measurement to be good or bad but uh, there is only work and you and also other artists who can encourage each other and I think this is like a utopia place for me <laughs> which I, I've always dreamt